During Tutumang meeting today, all members of the provincial assembly, including five Borobe MPs, agreed to give more time for a province-wide consultation with all stakeholders. A report on that consultation, together with the draft bill, will be presented to Tutumang by mid-April for its endorsement. They said the Lay Eben local level government was established under an organic law and therefore it is unconstitutional for an act of parliament to remove a function of a legitimate body. We have an act of parliament and even to a more or lesser extent a regulation that will be defined the boundaries come in to basically usurp and take over the powers and functions of a democratically elected government. The Tutumang pointed out today that the proposed draft bill on the Lay City Authority was believed to have come into operation on the 1st of January 2015. They claim it came into operation without meaningful participation and consultation with Morobe provincial government. What now the Morobe leaders have agreed upon is for wider consultations from all district that contributes and gets serviced from Lay City. Bololo people have to be also consulted and other eight districts or seven districts must be consulted including the, uh, uh, the boundaries of um, the Lay City which includes the Nawai people and the Yuan Gulf people. So uh, wider consultations must be in place now. The draft Lay City Authority bill together with the report will be presented to the National Executive Council for deliberations and to the parliament for its enactment in May 2015. Sylvester Gawi, National MTV News, Lay.